step eight, update the detail layout file to support the notion of arrays and spinners. Okay, so the next thing that I'd love to do is to go back to the activity detail layout file, which currently looks like this. Now I would like to make a few updates on it. Okay, so as you can see, the, the price of each movie is being covered by these new views which I have just added. So the first thing that I like to do is to update this thing. I don't want the price label right now to go right to the bottom. I actually want it to go above the this label here, above the name number of tickets. Okay, and so let's add the layout above attribute. Okay. And as you can see, the label is now positioned above the number of tickets, which is good, which is what I want. I would like to do a similar thing for the value of the price itself, actually. Okay, so I would like to delete the align parent button attribute and replace that with the layout above attribute. And as you can see, it's now positioned nicely right next to the uh, price label. Okay, right. Okay, so the next thing that I also added is this label itself which is basically enables the user to select the number of the tickets that they want to buy from this movie because right next to this label is a spinner now this spinner will display uh, some numbers for example 1 to 10 or 1 2 3 4 5 6 so the user would be able to select the number of tickets that they want to buy okay and the next thing that I've also added is this, which is basically a text view label, which reads subtotal, okay? And this is a label for this value here. And so, what is this value? This basically displays the number, the subtotal. What does that mean? That means if the user, for example, selects one ticket of this movie in here, then one times that price will give you this price here. If the user selects two, then the subtotal will also be shown in here, that's two times the price, and so on and so forth. And finally, I've added a book movie button, which I will be talking about later. That's it. Thank you, and happy coding. <laughs> Anti,